Hi, you guys. I'm just here at the store seeing how there's shortages on supplies, too. I showed y'all video stream shortages, food shortages, and um, Walmart. This is another store where they have shortages of other different things, as you guys can see. I want to show you guys things that I'm seeing out here. Why it's imperative to prep and get the things that you need. It may be the little odds and ends of things, but there's so many shortages of all types of different things out here. I mean extreme shortages, y'all. Wow. What's on this aisle here? Paper essentials. Here. Folders. Box file. Okay. Those microwaves, a lot of those microwaves left from over here because the evacuees came into town and a lot of them were in the Ida evacuees. A lot of them were in hotels that uh, didn't have kitchens, but they had, I mean, they didn't have kitchens. They didn't have microwaves and stuff. So they had their, all their families. So in order for them to eat, they had to uh, get microwaves. So a lot of the microwaves, a lot of the food, a lot of the um, water, different supplies because generators, they had to come and get a lot, a lot of different things. Because they city, they whole state was out. The whole state was out of water, of lights. And water. The water was contaminated. Because you know when the grid goes down, the water is, is nasty. Shortages right there. So, uh, see all these are things that we just need to learn from. Not get worried about, but just learn from it and prepare for it. These are medications. They're gone. Tylenols, Tylenols, acetamin, Tylenol gel. Y'all go get your stuff. Seriously. <laughs>